Hello everyone and welcome back to another video or welcome if you're new. I'm Cora and I'm here with Liam. The wonderful Lily. Lily Boy Lee Boy Sen. And today Liam, we're Jimmy James. <laughs> and today we're back with another episode of Build and Babble, the show. I keep wanting to say show, it's not a show. The it's series. The show. The series where I build something. And then Lily and I are just gonna talk about random topics. Yes. So if you have any topic suggestions that you would want us to discuss, uh, could be philosophical, political, anything. Conspiratorial. <laughs> that's I don't know if word. that's a word. <laughs> <That doesn't laughs> I just wanted to fit what you That does not were seem like a word. Um, but yeah, it could be anything. Could be anything silly. Like it doesn't have to be super deep. It could be funny. Like just random questions. Anything. Mm -hmm. yeah. But today we're gonna talk about something that Sima Aaron, a good oh, friend of mine, on. shout out to Aaron, asked. Yes. You need to tell him first what the build is. The build is a really cute island cafe that I made because I love doing. Um, like public lots and Erin the person that's Erin the person that also suggested the topics she also keeps saying I need to do more public lots so yeah, yeah. this is for you Erin <laughs> both the build and the talk <laughs> no and for everyone else that listens obviously um yeah and it's, I think it's just it's a very simple build but I feel like that fits the island I don't think they'd have a super crazy cafe you know it's just a chill place with a little pool and stuff and then cute. today we don't have that much time so today we're quickly going to talk about our worst and best possible days that we could have right it's yes. like a what would be the potentially best the best or potentially the worst day ever i think my best day would just be really really chill and have a lot of time to play games but also Classic. i think it involves some pets stroking some pets. stroking <laughs> kittens some stroking yeah, stalking some yeah. kittens, then someone would make me some really nice food. Not unhealthy, because afterwards, if I eat unhealthy stuff, I feel bad. Yeah. So that's not the best yeah. day. So it would be something that tastes really good, but isn't necessarily super bad for you. And then that is maybe a glass of wine or something. Oh, yeah. Like at a night. treat. Then watching something, yeah. you know, like, and having no neck pain, that would be my best day. That would be nice. Just having no neck pain would be my best day. My, yeah, mine would probably you? consist of a nice workout early in the morning. You know, where you can really get like... Oh my god, he hasn't worked amazing. out in like I haven't, no, and I really want to again, but I just, I don't know, I'm drained lately. So if you're a really good workout in the morning, uh -huh. and then a really nice breakfast with my girl. With the girl. And then, you know, a bit of Overwatch, a bit of probably Spyro. Now that Spyro has come out for anyone who doesn't know, Spyro is out. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, like you, like watch something in the evening, maybe have a beer or something. Yeah. And just chill. Maybe even for me going out, like oh, yeah, if it's nice say, weather, the like to, yeah. I enjoy doing stroke that. Stroke the goats. <laughs> the worst day for me would be any day where I have to go to a new place. Mm hmm. Now, if I start something new like uni, internships, jobs, that's always the worst days I could yeah. imagine. Um, where I'd have to wake up at 5 a.m. That would already be bad. Anything before 8 is really stressful for me. I'm like, I wouldn't say I'm a long, like, I don't think I sleep in too much. I've only done it recently, but um, yeah, I don't enjoy getting up before 8 anymore because now that I'm in uni, it starts at 10 the earliest, so I don't... It's not like I need to wake up before 8. Yeah. Which is really good for me because whenever I had school and I had to get up at 6 or something, it just... It makes me unhappy and, like, it's not mm -hmm. my sleeping rhythm. Yeah. Like, I can probably tell that it's not the way my body works. Like, yeah, I'm, I wouldn't say I'm mm -hmm. a night owl either. Like, if I stay up too late and sleep and I feel bad, but... You're Sleeping from between, like 12 to 8 is yeah. like my perfect. Yeah, it is. Or 1 to 9. That's like my perfect one to schedule. Nine, yeah, and then doing something stressful, having to, I don't know, use public transport. No, I don't mind public no, transport, but like really. something like that would really stress me out. Yeah. No, being on a bus would be the worst oh day because God, I, hate I hate buses. buses <laughs> it makes man. me feel buses sick. Buses are just ridiculously bad. Yeah, and then if it's really cold, that would be terrible because the weather... Like, I love winter, I but ears. I hate it here in Berlin. Oh, yeah, a windy day would be my worst <laughs> day because I have very, very sensitive ears, yeah. which is really weird, but <clears throat> they do hurt. Like, I'm... I would say I'm... My pain tolerance is really high. Like, I don't... 
I'm not a whiner. You know, I don't. No, because like when I hurt no, myself, no, I, know. I can yeah. stand a lot of pain without being like, oh, yeah, like get this on hurts it, me. Like it's all right for me, but my ears are like. Unless oh. it's bleeding. I just don't, you don't like. like it. I just need to put blood. something on and then yeah. I'm fine. But yeah, how about you? Worst day would be having to wake up at six to go into work and then realizing everything the day before that I'd done was wrong and <laughs> a super stressful day. It's happened a few times What's that already. Today? No, it wasn't today. Today was really chill. But Liam does like to go to work early. Like he prefers I his prefer, early Yeah, because we, we work in shifts and like you can do anything from like eight in the morning until Starting half past four in the evening. Or you could start at half past 11 in the morning until 8 p.m. And obviously that's really bad. Yeah, like, so you start anywhere around 8 to 11, 30 in the yeah. morning and then wait, work yeah. your eight and a half So hours. of course I like to be back at like, well, I like to finish at 4.30 because then I'm home at 4.45 and it's just super chill. You've got the whole evening. Yeah, being home at 4.30 is really good. You still have so much time. I'm a bit yeah. worried about because I'm starting an internship. I heard back from them. <laughs> I'm starting an internship on the 17th of October, which is scaring me a lot. That's so also, my soon. worst day would um, include talking to a lot of people I don't know because that makes me super anxious. Because just going out with friends to a restaurant is already kind of stressful if I don't know the restaurant. If I do know the restaurant, it's fine and I'm doing okay. Yeah. It's just that some restaurants here, like the hip ones, sometimes mm-hmm. you just have to go to the bar to order yeah. and sometimes you don't and it takes yeah. me a little bit to figure out like, yeah, I don't know do I just sit down do I go, yeah. like some of them stay on the menus like go Self to the counter or, or whatever yeah but like when they don't it can be <laughs> not I don't know not it horrible but it's kind of because weird it I don't want to sit down and then because here and I know in America you get seated you don't sit down yourself but here you just pick a place you, space you want and you sit down there yeah. like you just pick a table and sit down and then the people serve you mm-hmm. so if it's not self-serving I don't want to go to the bar and be like I would like this and this because then I think I come across rude being like well you didn't serve me yeah, quick enough really? kind of thing yeah, yeah but it's not that way I just that, like you know but it, yeah. I guess it does come you gotta kind of suss it out whilst you're there right yeah um, it would also include getting my blood drawn <laughs> oh god because <What laughs> that's my worst taking nightmare a, walking a windy walk taking with a lot the of bus wasps around taking to the, the hospital to get your blood drawn <laughs> to do it all this on the way back and then go to my first day of in your work or oh god yeah <laughs> year of uni or whatever waking up early <laughs> yeah Windy walk. That would be bus, that would be my drawn, worst day. Anyways, I'd love to know what your best and worst days would yes. look like. It's always really interesting. I think it tells you a lot of people. Like my best day is literally just chill, stroking some animals, and <laughs> I'd be happy. <laughs> like like just petting dogs. animals, like yeah. little puppies and kittens, is like my dream. But if you enjoyed this video, please don't <laughs> forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you have not already. And I'll see you in Friday's video. Bye. Bye.